Citizens want to enjoy city life, have space and be free. Enjoying culture and leisure time, meeting friends, playing sports, working and shopping. All as near as possible to your own front door. If we can find better solution, in particular for urban mobility, this translates not only in better environmental impacts in our cities, but also on healthier lifestyle, more satisfaction in life, and also more time that we can dedicate to other activities. And that's what we're working on with the pilot of Smart City Travel. We nudge people to park their cars outside the city and then switch modes of transport. And then it can then travel the last mile to the city center. In Munich, we want to combine existing and new mobility services in a meaningful way for better accessibility and more space in public areas. One example of our projects is a neighborhood project in Munich in which we collaborate with uh, residents and shops and retailers and ask them how they want to improve the public spaces in the neighborhood as well as how their mobility needs can be fulfilled. A European historical inner city is very different from one in the US and China. And therefore we have diverse answers, strategies and solutions. And very clearly, BMW wants to be part of that quest for better solutions. Los Angeles is known the world over for many exciting things, but also for heavy traffic and the resulting air pollution. And these are some of the biggest challenges that we face here in Los Angeles. And so we have a great opportunity now to bring together partners from the public and the private sector to work together to find innovative solutions to address these challenges that impact the daily lives of Angelinos. Understanding the attitude towards the private vehicle is very important because everything here is built around a car. This is why we just started a huge survey together with our partner from the Karlsruhe Institute of Technology and the University of California, Davis. This car dependency study will give us more insights about what people actually want and need here in Los Angeles. One good example is the reservation-based mobility project. We are now transferring this process to the road. That means the drivers are able to block a lane or a time slot in advance with their app, which helps them to reach the destination on time. Of course, people want to live in clean cities. And we can do that by improving the air quality and reducing local CO2 emissions, maybe even eliminating them. To that, electric cars are key. In the future, we want electric charging to be as accessible as possible in the city. Car owners are notified by our app that their car is sufficiently charged and ready to be reparked. From there on, we don't leave them alone. The app makes a suggestion where to park the car next. And by doing so, the charging point is ready for the next user. We see collaboration as the key to success when it comes to sustainable mobility. Not only between us as a car maker and city governments, but involving all kinds of municipal stakeholders. We develop intelligent solutions for cities that offer freedom of individual mobility for all. We live in a time in which we really need to act to solve the climate crisis and to really improve sustainability in transportation. Rethinking mobility is key 